Good morning. We are uh, with Nikolai from Spoke Wanderer. Nikolai just managed to start his Ducati Multistrada after eight months. So uh, you better watch his uh, channel, watch his latest video about that topic because it's, it will be a very interesting one. Today we're planning a short trip close to Bucharest, about 80-85 kilometers. We're gonna visit a special place, a special uh, restaurant, a special, uh, so to say, place where uh, the Asian medieval food is cooked there. So you better stay tuned. Unfortunately, we have a motorcycle accident here. Hopefully the rider is safe. Our today's destination is a great traditional gastronomy project called the Dacian Farm. Established in 2013, this location has in time become a place of story where the past reaches the present only to remind us from time to time that the Asian values must be carefully preserved and transmitted with pride. Come along with us until the destination because also the road until there passes one of the most famous vineyards regions in Romania called Tohani. I'm traveling along with Nikolai, he's coming back in Romania for a few days to prepare its Ducati Multistrada to be delivered to United Emirates, where he's now established. More about this process and many other related videos you'll find out on his channel, Spoke Wanderer. We have reached the city of Mizil. This city was uh, very famous during the communism time for its couches, very comfortable couches called Relaxa. After this boring city called Mizil, we have in front of us uh, one of the nicest parts of the road, the road which passes through the vineyards. Tohan Vineyard has an area of 500 hectares, of which 366 hectares of wine on fruit and is located on the 45 degree parallel, like the famous Bordeaux Vineyards. Located in the middle of the Delomare region, Tohan spreads on seven sunny hills, oriented towards the southeast, so the grapes enjoy 14 more days of sun than in any other wine area in the country. In 1948, Tohan Romania becomes state-owned and the cellars are built. The cellars remain to this day a great place to visit as a museum that preserves the only collection winery in the area with over 100,000 bottles of wine stored.
ya this look at this uh, this uh, traditional buildings here you can actually uh, stay it's uh, they're working like accommodation over there there is a place for a fire a fireplace a big one this is the tree house yeah this place it's uh, special that's why we choose to come here we just ordered some uh, some food at the moment and we're waiting but let me show you around a little bit As you can see, uh, there is a generous space over here. After you serve some, uh, some dishes, you can relax here. There is plenty of space, a lot of uh, places to stay. You can also uh, check out the horses. There are the bungalows, which we uh, already passed them. The restaurant over here. So actually here you have a lot of uh, animals, there are rabbits, there are horses, uh, also mangalitsa pigs and also deers, there are some deers. You can also make uh, uh, horse rides around this wine, wine yard. There is the fish house, Pescaria Tohania. Hopefully we can see the deers, the guy said just, uh, just on the left side over here. There are some other accommodations over there, uh, different ones, which are placed uh, also in the surroundings. They are more quiet. All right, we found the place where the deers are. Usually they should be here. Check them out. Oh, they're beautiful. How are you? Check them out. Aren't they nice? Three big ones and uh, I think uh, another three and one over there. Very nice. Check it out. <laughs> this is the smoked bean soup and some magalitsa sausages, potatoes, onion, some uh, spicy sauce. Looks amazing. We finally arrived at the destination. It was uh, it um, was an interesting day so far. A very pleasant ride. Very pleasant ride. Uh, very nice roads, uh, village roads. Uh, the day was perfect. The surface was perfect. We enjoyed uh, quite a nice meal on the Ferma Dacilor. Sumptuous. 
<laughs> maybe too much, maybe too much. Uh, we saw the deers, we saw the horses, uh, still a lot of places to be seen. But now we are preparing for a live together with Nikolai. You can watch it live on the Spoke Wanderer YouTube channel. So stay tuned, watch, uh, watch us on the live stream on uh, Spoke Wanderer YouTube channel. Bye bye for now, until next time, see you around. Ciao. <laughs>